What's poppin' people? My name is Jonah from Baskill, and today I'm going to be showing you our latest plugin, AI Color Match Pro, for After Effects and Premiere Pro. Let's get into it. So it works pretty much the same in After Effects and Premiere Pro. We're in After Effects right now. And I have this shot of me from a music video on a roof, and I'm pretty happy with it, except for the fact that it doesn't really have any color grading. And let's say I'm at the end of the video, and I know I want it to look like this cool video that I like. But applying all of those edits manually seems like it would take a long time. Not anymore. All we have to do is add AI color match, select the music video that I like as the color style image, and then press match here. That's pretty much it. That looks pretty cool. So it does this match with an AI model that runs locally on your own machine. We're able to adjust the intensity of it with this slider here, going all the way from the effect off to the match fully applied. We can also export the matches a lot with this button here. Save it to our desktop and then let's say we're in another project. Could be in After Effects or any other program. And we have the same type of footage we want to apply that same look to. Well, we can simply use the LUT. And look at that, pretty cool. All right, so we're in Premiere now just to show you how it works in Premiere. I want to show you another use case. So this is a real project that I used it in. This is a comedy set that I filmed. And this is what the footage looked like right out of my camera. I applied some color correction to it. Then my friend shot from a different angle with his Canon, and you can see it looks extremely different. And it looks even different compared to my original shot. So I could go in and manually try to match them. That would be a headache. Why not just use AI color match? I've taken in my shot on to track three here, so I've just hidden it, but you can see that's just the other sequence. And then if we choose video track three as the color style image and press match here, you can see it does a pretty good job if we compare it. I would say that did almost all the work. We can try also doing it at some different frames. It might give slightly different results. Um, just because whatever frame you're currently on on the timeline is the one that'll be used for the style and reference images, which you can also see here. So I feel pretty good about that. I would say it brought it 90% of the way there and then maybe I'll just use some simple color wheels to fix the red that I see in the shadows here in the curtain. So it should be easy enough to just drag that down a little bit. And yeah, that looks a lot better to me. If we turn off the adjustment layer, we can see the original shot versus what we have now. Pretty dramatic improvement. And we can compare that as well to the shot from my camera that we used as the style reference and looks pretty similar to me. Again, you could export that as a LUT here and then use it in another program or another project. Another advantage of AI Color Match Pro is that you have 32 and 16 bits per channel color support. So a lot more detail is preserved if you want to then later on go do more edits. So that does it for this overview video. I hope you found it helpful. If you have any questions or want to reach out to us, you can use our Discord, which is linked on the sales page which I'll also put in the description down below. And everyone out there, please take care of yourself because you deserve it. You really, really do. Thank you.